Hi, my name is Don. I'm with SwivelChairParts.com and I'm going to be showing you today how to remove a gas cylinder using a pipe wrench. But before we get started, let me show you a few of the items that you'll need. You'll need some WD-40, a pipe wrench, longer is better, maybe a screwdriver, a hammer and heavier is better and of course you'll need a replacement gas cylinder and some newspaper okay here's what we're going to do you tip the chair over onto the front of the chair seat and by the way i like working on the floor because i can produce a lot more leverage with the wrench. I'm turning the chair like this so that the chair will, uh, won't tip or roll around as much. It's leaning on its arms. Taking some WD-40 after I put the newspaper down like that. I'm going to squirt it in the joint. Come on. Just one squirt will do it. You should let it sit for a few minutes before you try to remove the gas cylinder. In this case, I've had the gas cylinder out so many times it comes out rather easy. So I'm, I'm moving the telescope, which is strictly for decoration purposes, out of the way. And I'm going to, with the wrench, twist it like that. You can twist in either direction. It's not screwed in. It'll come off like that. Take the cover and just pull it off. That way it keeps it in the proper order. Take the base of the chair. Let it on something solid, a workbench. Now you'll need your hammer, and this one won't be hard for me to take off either. Off. Take your new gas cylinder. Remove the labels. We use a removable label. You don't need to scrape it off. Although this one you do. <laughs> there we go. There we go. We got them all off except for that one little strip. Wipe off any residue of the WD-40 like that. Telescope. Put it on like that. Take the chair base. Place it on the column. Turn the chair over. That's all there is to it. By the time you sit in the chair, once, twice, three times, you'll need a wrench to take the gas cylinder off. It fits very, very tight. Thank you.